Devre Hayamim Rishon, 1 Chronicles 18. Now, after this it came to pass that David smote Eth the Pelishtim and subdued them and took Eth Gath and her towns out of the hand of the Pelishtim. And he smote Eth Moab and the Moavim became David's servants and brought gifts. And David smote Eth, Eth, rather smote Eth Hadar Ezer, king of Sova, unto Hamath, as he went to establish his dominion by the river Parath. And David took from him a thousand chariots and seven thousand horsemen and twenty thousand footmen. David also hoed eth all the chariot horses, but reserved of them a hundred chariots. And when the Aramim of Damascus came to help Hadar Ezer, king of Sova, David slew of the Aramim two and twenty thousand men. Then David put garrisons in Aram Damascus. And the Aramim became David's servants and brought gifts. Thus Yahuwah preserved David whithersoever he went. And David took at the shields of gold that were on the servants of Hadar Ezer and brought them to Yerushalayim. Likewise, from Tiv Chath and from Kun, cities of Hadar Ezer, brought David very much brass, wherewith Shalomah made Eth the brazen sea, and Eth the pillars, and Eth the vessels of brass. Now, when Tou king of Hamath heard how David had smitten Eth all the host of Hadar Ezer, king of Sova, he sent Eth Hadoram, his son, to King David, to inquire of his wealth and to congratulate him because he had fought against Hadar Ezer and smitten him. For Hadar Ezer had war with Tou, and with him all manner of vessels of gold and silver and brass. Them also King David dedicated unto Yahweh with the silver and the gold that he brought from all these nations, from Edom and from Moab and from the children of Ammon and from the Pelishtim and from Amalek. Moreover, Abishai, the son of Tesorah, slew of Eth the Edomim in the Valley of Salt 18,000, and he put garrisons in Edom, and all the Adamim became David's servants. Thus Yahweh preserved Eth David whithersoever he went. So David reigned over all Yashadael and executed judgment and justice among all his people. And Yoav the son of Seruyah was over the host, and Yahushaphat the son of Achilud, recorder, and Sedach, the son of Achtuv, rather Achituv, and Avimelech, the son of Aviathar, were the priests, and Shavsha was scribe, and Bene Yahu, the son of Yahuyada, was over the Kerathim, and the Pelathim, and the sons of David were chief about the king.